Yeah, well, I would first say like shout out to Jenny, right? Like love Jenny, standing her ground and being like, well, the whole point of this show is an exchange of ideas, mm-hmm. and like Shannon disagrees with you literally all the time. <laughs> like that's all they do on the show is like one person says something, the other one says something, and a lot of times those things are at odds, and there's no like I don't want to hear from you. I think it's very clear that he just didn't feel like his job was to engage with her. Um, I think that's that's very sad, and I I don't like that her work environment or serving like okay, well I want to say something, but he might not even want to hear it. And what she said was even controversial it was just her opinion on an opinion based show. So she was completely in her rights and in you know doing what her job was, just adding to the conversation and then saying what she thought about a given topic. I think that every woman in sports has it one point in their career or at many points in their career that like people only wanted to look at them but not hear them right or see them but not listen to them but that's not the job um so i'm glad that jenny really didn't realize like i'm here because i have something to add um i'm a valuable and necessary part of this program Mm -hmm. and i would love for us to shift away from these these kind of um these pieces of content where it feels like the woman is only there to police the men, right? Where it's like, okay, I'm going to set this up and you guys go ahead. It should be like a constant conversation and the host is there, you know, to segue to different parts of it, but everyone should be saying what they think and feel. So I'm glad that Jenny realized like I'm here because I'm an important part of the show and I'm going to say whatever. I hope that there was some private conversation they had after and maybe hopefully one public one, where Skip is like, I should not have treated my colleague this way. You know, we are peers, we are equal in this sense, but unfortunately, I think that's how a lot of people view the role of women in journalism or on these talk shows, and that's just simply not not the case. Yeah, I, I know it's, it's funny that you say that because I, when I watch these talk shows, I'm always like, why do they put the young lady in the middle, like she's refereeing these two guys or why does she, you know, I feel like they have a, a, a lot to say, you know, just watch the Olympics. Some of the best athletes were the women. And, and we, as men sometimes think we just superior in every way. And, but to me, I'm like, I, you know, raised by a woman, you know, my dad was in the picture, but I was raised by a woman. I, I know the hustle that they got to do and the grind they got to do to just to get their voices heard. And for me, there's so many women out there that are smarter than us and we try to hold them back. And so it's just for Skip to do that. I was like, when I saw that, I heard about it, like, dude, let us speak, man. Let me like, nah, nah, yeah, nah, nah. I'm like, so funny. Like, you know, you know, I, I, yes. Like, what is that going on here? <laughs> it so reminded I, me I, some stuff that yeah. happens in Georgia. <laughs> Yeah. Hey, whatever. Hey. <laughs> always comes back to a shot at Atlanta. Okay. <laughs> okay. It always reminds me of something that happens in Alabama. How about that? All right. Yeah, that'd be better. 